fears. We've all got them. I think this is really similar to how I started out my flaws video. Oh well. So like I said, fears. We've all got them. I know I've already said that, but oh well. I am here today to present you with some of my fears and some of the things I'm paranoid about. Okay, so one of my biggest fears and or things I am paranoid about is oversleeping and being late to work or just being late to work in general, I guess. But seriously, that is a fear that drives me. And just the thought of being late puts like this knot in my stomach. I just can't do it. Another fear of mine, and this is one I've had for quite a while now, is getting sniped in my back or the back of my head. Now, you you may think that sounds ridiculous, but sadly that is a really big fear of mine for some reason. It's funny when I say it and when I talk about it like this, but it's not so funny when the feeling actually comes upon me and I'm like seriously thinking I'm gonna die. Yeah. Another thing I'm really paranoid about is having to go to the doctor for something that's wrong with my foot. If you've watched my pet peeves video, then you know I am not a foot person. Feet like really gross me out. And the thought of having to have my feet looked at or touched or whatever, I just... I can't do it. Other more common and I guess more normal fears I have would be like a fear of the ocean. I don't like that there's parts of it that are still undiscovered and that there's like so many weird creatures in it. But I guess that sort of goes along with my complicated fear of fish. Complicated in that I eat fish and there's some fish I think are cute. I have had pet fish in the past, but I also have nightmares about fish. Like I said, it's complicated. Stupid fish. I'm also afraid of the dark, but that's more typically in unfamiliar places. Maybe you think that's something I should have grown out of, but you know, I still eat Chef Boyardee and fruit snack shaped like dinosaurs. I still have stuffed animals on my bed. Right now. And I never grew out of loving Batman. Or Hello Kitty. So yeah, maybe I still sleep with the light on. But it's not because I'm afraid of monsters under the bed or the boogeyman. I'm afraid of getting murdered. Getting my head chopped off in the middle of the night. That's right. Murder. Shoot, I ain't got no kid fears. My fears be grown, dog. My fears be mature and stuff. Now to quickly go through the rest of the things I fear or am paranoid about. Saliva from adults, kids, babies. It's disgusting. Pooping or peeing myself in public. This isn't something that's come close to happening, but it is still a fear. You never know. Dying with a bunch of regrets. I wouldn't mind having some. I guess I just don't want to have a whole bunch. Randomly losing a bunch of my hair or having a bunch of my hair cut off. I remember first having this fear like years ago. I mean there's lots of different ways it could happen. I've thought of everything from someone fainting and me going to catch them and them accidentally biting off a chunk of my hair as they were falling. Or me accidentally cutting off a bunch of my hair while I'm working on a craft project. Maybe I'm cutting away at something and I lean in a little too close and snip Oh, there it goes. The possibilities are truly endless. Truly endless. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. You may think this was one big joke, but I am sad to inform you that no, these were true fears of mine. I'd be curious to find out what some of your guys' fears or paranoias are. So please leave them in the comments below, and I will see you guys in another video. Bye!